What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to teach you how to add sketch marks and circles, squares, annotations, almost arrows, and just stuff like that in Camtasia Studio. So the first thing you want to do is open up a Camtasia Studio recording and then click call out and then there will probably be an arrow so you can just click on an arrow and then it will pop up in the left screen the left corner screen and then you can resize it so you can like aim it here you can rotate it so it can be like that you can type stuff in it here you can have it fade in Uh, you can change the font and stuff like that so you can have that type um, bigger arrow just different type of arrow here's the annotation type it's just a, a box you can change the color so I think okay it's right here fill and then you click red and then you know you got your background and you can change it to yellowish or darker yellow you know you got green so that's pretty cool and you just type whatever you want here in case you you don't have a microphone or it conked out or something and then you can add like a pow a uh, thought bubble you got circle square that type of arrow squiggly arrow cartoonish arrow and then you got these red marks which is kind of what it's like a draw so this doesn't have any text in it, but like you can underline stuff with this. It looks like an underline almost. Or you can have a check mark. You know, just check it off. Uh, you can't have a fill. I think it's more. Yeah, it's a border. You can have a little arrow pointing. A drawing box. So I'm gonna play that. So it's gonna look like this. Never mind. I'm gonna put it right here, and then it'll fade in, like it'll draw it like this. It'll draw like that, and the same with the circle or anything else. Then you can just click that little arrow and choose it. You got traditional keystrokes, and then you got your little key, and you can type whatever you want in it. So, control V, and then it'll do that. So, you can do stuff like that. Um, you can just have normal text, it'll just appear right there. You can add an image, you know, kind of like a watermark, but I wouldn't really recommend it. A uh, transparent hotspot. Let me just delete some of these things because they're starting to get in the way. Uh, let's go back to that transparent hotspot. Let's see, I'm not exactly sure how this works. I've never really used this before. But I think what it is, it just kind of highlights that part, and that's why you can see spotlight. Uh, a blur call out so it it'll blur that part a spotlight which means it darkens everything of course and then you can add you know like a zoom and pan stuff so like, you know it highlights it and makes it look really cool and this is more advanced stuff I wouldn't really recommend this you gotta do something really fast because this can get very complicated you can also have a highlight you know, kind of like a yellow highlight uh, effects. You know, you got your transparency. Um, you can have a shadow on some things. Let's see, what else can you have? You got some just normal sketches, kind of like a comic book almost. So you got shapes of text, shapes, uh, sketch motion, and special. So you know, you got your traditional keystrokes, spotlight, blur, highlight. Transparent hotspot. Okay, here's a highlight call out. Yeah. So it's just some really cool things that you might not know how to do in Camtasia Studio.
7. Thank you for watching. Who's watching?